Hey there, everyone, this is Zhao Cao playing, uh, Dvai, also known as Dvai. Uh, last time I did a thing, so, uh, so, here's the thing. I tried the labyrinth, and I was like, yeah, I tried this labyrinth, I guess that happened. Of course, there's more to it. So, remember how I got the sweet clock manual? Each route has a special prize like that. The clock manual was the special prize of the middle dungeon. And I only have one wing. I guess I'll buy another one right now. So I'm just, I'll buy it right now in case I forget. Uh, oh. Talking about the earthquake. Everyone talking about the earthquake. Uh, yeah, so... So, you don't... You're not supposed to learn the thing. Like, I think that they are like... What's here again? Oh, yeah. Hey! So here you are, rebuilding your plane. Are you the camper? Wemmick. Oh, I see. It's kind of crazy, yeah. Yeah, no, no, yeah, that makes sense. Where, where is the guy? Like, where is he? Where, where's Miles? I've got like, uh, I got like an engine that I could probably give him. And I got like, uh, also a propeller. But, like, he didn't tell me anything. He's just like, oh, we get here, and then get stuck. Can't climb over the roots, that would be ridiculous. Are we going to whale again? Oh, there he is! You're hidden by all your stuff. Uh, he's repairing his plane, or a kayak, he's adapting it. Oh, an aeroplane. Uh, it's like a plane, but he put an arrow in front of it. That's fair. Huh, alright. Hey, I got parts. I don't know if there are more parts, though. Alright. Hey, look at that! I got these right here in my inventory. Hmm. Alright, well, how about... Yeah, that's the engine and the propeller, both in the same text box. Both survive pretty intact somehow. <laughs> that's fine. Yeah. Oh ho, Papira with that running gag. All the parts I need. All right, we got uh, uh we got a uh, we got a hat tip. But you don't got a tap. You got you don't got a hat. You can tip though. You got a soft hat. Hmm. All right. Hey, let's build a plane. That is such a weird saying. All right. Whatever. Thank you for just ruining the mood there, Tapiro. You're the best. Look at that. It's got this like scaffoldings and everything. <laughs> it has the shape of a plane. Wonder what Papira like Paco actually did to help out. Other than like just manual labor, I guess. Alright, well that's was kinda cool. Alright, so nothing more to it than that, but that's gonna lead us somewhere. They lighten up my inventory. Yeah! Alright, well, you guys have fun. I gotta go and do the labyrinth. Yeah, so the labyrinth, there's not like a set path you can learn on the internet. It's uh, semi randomized. Uh huh, yeah, mushrooms. Yeah, children's cool. All right, so I got the hard course, so let's try and get the nice prize for the easy course. And then there's so, but like, it's basically, you kind of have to intuit where the end is, is gonna be. It's an intuition puzzle and a slightly do the wrong path. Puzzle. Oh, I can go here and get a little bit of money, I guess. That was not my destination, but maybe I will find it one day. Whoa, an enemy. So enemies can happen. They're there to make you waste your time. That's fine. It's like a kite. I don't get it. 
Paper craft will bring you sorrow if you give it time. Alright, I think I missed it. Well, that's fine, I guess. It's- whoa, jeez. So the shape should be different now. And like, like, like that's kind of the thing. You can't, like, learn it. Uh, well, there's a, hey, a little bit of money, like a little bit of a reimbursement. So you can have an enemy sometime that flies by and makes my cat meow. It's a cute meow, though. Oh, that's a rock. That's not a prize. Oh, uh, what? Oh, there's a switch or something? I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing at all in this fanciful world. That's a prize. It's a red chest. Yeah. Then we're gonna destroy this guy. Oh, he doesn't even hurt me. Or barely. We just give well, No, that's not true. We got the good part. So look at that. It's the cursed clock. I got a clock now. Oh shoot, and yeah, and we got like, so I just got a clog, okay, I can do that at the very least. Uh, but now it's not in my inventory anymore, right? But I think I need it in my inventory. Oh, but I think I can buy another one from the key item guy. Like, it's pretty clear that I got some fairly, yeah. Fairly detailed help there. I, I there was just no helping it. I think because I uh, the thing is this is all leading to something. Like I think like the real content of the thing is when you get on the thing. George Jordan it up Georgetown. So this is fifty thousand. I have one attempt at this right now. So, I have to find them, because otherwise I can't just try immediately. I'm gonna have to come back when I have more money. So, like, that's a little unfortunate, but that's just what it is. So, let's hope I'm lucky. Yeah, at least I can get some money back. Uh, maybe I can make my money back at the end, I don't know. Okay, no, yeah, I can afford one more shot now because of those little, like, vaults. Man, like, this could be anywhere. Just kinda run. Oh, that one's already open? How does that even happen? Yeah, gonna try again. But yeah, and then, like, I am broke. So, basically, if I don't get it, I guess I could... What I should've done is maybe, like, save? <laughs> And reload, but I didn't, so I could reload from the start and just redo everything I've done today, to be fair. I could. It would feel bad, but... Maybe that's the rational way of doing this. Ah, oh, shoot, I got kind of stuck in geometry. No! here to save post plan so that uh, I you know wow I got it like immediately <laughs> okay it's in this weird like path where that's all you get though or is it just the way that this particular thing spawned? Like, there's just, like, nothing anywhere. Very awkward. I get a little bit of money. Super awkward. So I guess I'm gonna go return and save. Is it cheating? A little bit. But it feels kind of in spirit for this game. In a weird way. Oh, the enemy respawned or something. Alright, well, whatever. I got the clock! And now I'm not gonna activate the clock, so that I keep the clock. 
and I don't have to pay for a new clock. I mean, not that it wouldn't matter. Like, I feel like I might have been here. Well, at least it's just I got money, so I can try again. Immediately, without having to reload immediately. Yeah, we were getting somewhere, maybe. Alright, well, we'll see if time remains true. Because, yeah, see, that vault is closed. Yeah, this is weird. Da, 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 da. Like, those vaults are open. Ah, stuck on geometry! I found it! I found it! I found it! I found it! Last second! Found it! It's another book. It's the warranty. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I got a sneeze gun. Sorry about that. <laughs> the user was formal complaint. Too bad. <laughs> what? What? Clock, manual, warranty, booklet are enchanted items. So this is what I heard. If you got all three items that you get, you get some kind of prize. Well, an event. Uh, so... Secret Passage and the Ancient Hollow. Find them, you may confront them with your dissatisfaction at will. Oh! So we got, like, some kind of special boss. Uh, it, you will still be in possession of the clock. Okay. <laughs> Look, can I just go? Screw it, I'm out. How does this work, though? Okay, let's leave. And come back and see if anything happens. Like, there's like a big hole there. Okay, do I need to like pay to go somewhere? Let me read this again. It just says in the ancient hollow. Is that like, maybe it could be like, there's a weird, uh, there's a place. Like, is that how you open this? Strange passage. Sealed up. It just says that it's sealed up, so I guess not. No, I can't use the flowers next to this. Hey, your store upgraded. Wow. The Bazaar in Argus. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's the adventure store. That makes sense. Why did you taunt him like that? Like, that's just mean. Alright, so what do you got? Uh huh. Uh, yeah. No, no, yeah, I have not. Oh, geez, yeah, okay. Oh, wow, that's pretty good. Just plus two to everything. Pearl ring. Doesn't say what it does, though. Okay, but still. Okay, this Santa hat gives you an extra. Ex you got just Santa equipment? You can become just big ol' Santa and just get exponentially luckier. That's just weird. Man, the more I think about it, the more I feel like I need to, like, buy my way into the thing, to do the thing. Oh, what are you doing? Stop saying things like that. 
Well, today's a really weird day. Let's do something with this. So, accidentally, I, uh, so, you know, my friend has been helping me out a little bit. I accidentally read something here that basically tells me what to do with those. I mean, maybe I would have figured out regardless. I don't know. Does it matter? Well, I don't know if I would have returned where you need to go to do that. You need to go to, um, the gnome zone. That's where you use those metal garbage. So let's find out what that's about. That, like, you don't have, like, a local, um, storage there. Hey. Uh-huh. Well, there's plenty of time left. Like, there's so much time for me to just waddle about. What are you talking about? I don't think we're doing any dungeoneering today. Bada bing, bada boom. Alright, this is all the same. Someone I gotta find somewhere. Does the guy that gave me the battery... Oh yeah, he was at a forge, right? Oh wait. So does he want my weird metal garbage for weird metal... Like, forging? Hey, buddy. Hey, great, but fear of time is running short. And it's like a person. It's a human. Very strong. Good choice. Alright. Macarl. What are you doing here? Okay. This sounds good. Alright. Ellipses. Possibly? I got question marks. I mean, I don't know if I would consider those good material. Okay. Yeah, I got all of that. 59 score. Okay. Alu aluminum gauges. Oh, gauges are gauntlets. That's just very strange. Uh, so it's speak to the human. Uh-huh. That's fair. I mean, that is exactly what's happening. Alright. Yeah, so that's what I- uh, yeah. 59. Okay, so there you go. So, what he's interested in is in the total. Now I got aluminum boots! Now what I need, though, is like... Possibly $50,000. I don't suppose you have that on you? Okay, so now I'm at 59 points, so at 70 I can have probably my next aluminum... So it's defense plus two, just outright, compared to my current gloves, which are... Defense plus one. So yeah, it's just a straight upgrade. Never buy equipment ever again. That's D2 boots. Oh, but I got offensive boots, though. I mean, the thing is, it's one for two. But right now I'm equal. I think I'm just gonna carry both. Yeah. So I think what I'm gonna- oh, I can just trash these heavy rests. I mean, they're fine, but they're not very useful for me right now. So what I'm gonna do though, is I'm gonna keep them there. Because right now I'm 500-500. In terms of offense and defense. But if I ever need to lean somewhere more one or the other, I'll keep them around so I can do the exchange. Like, I think that's just... The smart thing to do here. Alright, that makes sense. I think. Like, is that it though? Like, is that today? Like, the problem is that I spend a lot of time doing weird things, but I feel like if I start a new chapter or whatever, a new dungeon, like, it's gonna take a bit and then it's gonna go too long. So this is it. This is the super awkward labyrinth stuff. Get things. Video games. That is the word. That is the title I've given it. It's not good, but it's what we got. 